Tuesday. I'm Aaliyah. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. Today, I'm just gonna bring y'all with me. I don't really know what I'm doing. I know I'm on my way to school, but other than that, I don't really know what I'm gonna be doing today. Um, I hope I brought my laptop charger. But yeah, make sure you like this video. If you like this video, subscribe if you haven't already, and also comment down below. Let me know how you doing. Yeah, I'm gonna be open with y'all, okay? I haven't really been on here much because I kind of doubt myself all the time. I'm like, eh, that's not good enough to show. Da, 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 da. Like, we actually go outside and we do a whole bunch of stuff, but then I'll be like, yeah, don't nobody want to see you outside all the time. Don't nobody want to see this and that or whatever. So it kind of, I don't know, I'll be having so much content and material on this phone. And then at the end of the day, I start down myself and then I just start deleting it all. Then I got to start all the way over. So hopefully, I don't do that today. But, um, Today is first of, the 1st of August. Happy August, y'all. Happy August. I have a lot of stuff this month that's going on. Um, first of all, like, I, it's stuff that I need to get ready for. I need to be preparing. I need to tighten this up because this is just all over the place. But anyway, it's things that I need to be preparing for. This month, um, I'm supposed to be flying out to Georgia so that I can go to the Beyonce's concert. So I need to still shop for that, y'all. And I leave in about 10 days. So I still need to shop. I think I thought, I feel like I know what I want to wear. I'm pretty much keeping it simple. I may take my hair down, put one of my wigs on, and, and just do that kind of thing, y'all. And just keep myself so, you know, keep everything simple. Because I really don't have time to be playing. And plus, I knew about this a while ago. I'm trying to fix this, y'all. But anyway, I knew about this a while ago. And I was just being lazy. And... And now I'm waiting till the last minute. I'm like, you know what? I'm going to just keep it simple. So I already got an idea of what I want to wear in my head. So hopefully I can go and get this stuff. If not, I'm going to have to make a quick uh, Amazon. Like I've been looking on the website, but for some reason, clothes are just not speaking to me. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's this new style or this new season worth of clothes or what, but they have not been speaking to me. So I'm going to um, figure it out, y'all. Um, also, at the end of this month, we're supposed to be going to uh, on a little trip with the church and stuff. So that's going to be cute. And I'm so excited. I can't wait. Um, there's also a few things that I want to try and get the kids to, um, you know, get the kids out and see. Hopefully, there's things going on the way that I plan them. But if not, like, this could be just a busy month for me in general. Um, I need to do some shopping. So y'all are going to see a lot of shopping hauls for me. Well, like, I don't know, probably one. But for me and Pat, and then there's stuff I need to get for the kids because I need to get fall and, fall and winter ready. So go see hauls for that. Go to see grocery hauls, all type of stuff. So I'm trying to go, I'm going to try and show you all as much as I possibly can because it is August and happy August. But, um, and I know I haven't really been consistent in this, something that I really want to do, even though I doubt myself so freaking much. But, um, like I really doubt myself because I started this channel off in one way and then I decided that I wasn't really feeling it because that's something that I just couldn't consciously do all the time especially with having time like I barely had time to breathe so I definitely wasn't going to have time to continue doing what I was doing and plus I just wanted to kind of build off with something else and like I know I probably should have just started a whole new channel and, and went from there but I didn't but um <laughs> yeah anyway let me go ahead and get off of here because I done already talked enough and I'll see y'all at school. Well, I put them on my leg. They're on my respiratory study guide. That's the, that's what the okay, I'm close to this. I think. Hey y'all, so I am back and I am out of school. Y'all, my look crack crack feel, but y'all, today was an okay day. Like, I just feel like the week is going by school. I don't know. I don't know. The week, the week is weird. I guess that's just the way it's going to be for now because I started feeling like this about two weeks ago. But, um, yeah, I was at school today and, you know, we did like fractions. And, well, not fractions, but we did the pharmacology math at the end of the day. And then this morning we did like community health and stuff. But, uh, I need to go over like some A&P stuff later. And I also need to go over the community health because the stuff we went over today, we're going to get a test on it tomorrow. Um, today i'm not cooking dinner because we are going to dinner with pat's parents so after we uh pat get home and you know he get himself situated then we're gonna get in the car go get the kids and then after we get the kids we'll go meet them at the restaurant or whatever um i may just wear what i got on i don't know or i may change my clothes i don't know yet um it's not like we gotta we go to be fancy it's not like we have to be fancy or nothing like that but y'all i just I just don't know okay so it was 
Um, our little classroom got a group. It's like some pettiness that's just doing the show. And I guess that's natural because it happens everywhere. But it just be things that just, like, for instance, we had this group on Facebook. And it, they made this group on Facebook like a month or two before school even started. It was one of the girls in the classroom. And I guess she got upset because of something a few weeks ago. And she deleted or she made the... Excuse me. Anyway, and she like deleted the page and just made it private or something like that. So we couldn't get on there and talk. And when we get on there, we pretty much sharing like the notes or the slides and people make quiz lists and put it in, um, keep up with the schedule and stuff like that. Well, anyway, it's this girl in the classroom. She do like the little quiz list and stuff too, like a few people do. And she do like the little quiz list or whatever. And she did a, cause we doing like respiratory system and we going over the, oh, let's go get them right We doing a respiratory system and uh, we're doing like the workbook version of stuff and you know, the book version and stuff like that. Cause the teacher that we have now, she's going in and out of all the books. Well, we are doing that and she um posted different kinds of quiz lists. She did one for the workbook, one for like the study guide and one for the book or something like that. But um, I was just going to look at the one for the workbook because I was like, well, it's easier than just going to grab my workbook and then, you know, taking it everywhere with me. I can get on the quiz list and I can, you know, test myself and whatever else so I can learn on the go. Well, apparently, when we tried to look at it before class was out, she put a password on it. I didn't even know you could put a password on a Quizlet, but she did. And people were just upset about it. And I was just like, you know what? It's out the, it's out the workbook or whatever. I said, well, all the way in the back of the book or whatever. You know, just being petty. I don't know why. I really don't know why. But, you know, all the way in the back of the book, that's the access to the workbook. So let's go to the work respiratory system part and put the answers in. And then just either take pictures of it or write the questions and answers down and stuff and just study that way or it should make your own quiz because what is what are you being so petty and stuff for but um anyway i was just like it's not the secret recipe it's like a go guarantee nobody at a and then there's other people that did respiratory system quiz lists and stuff like that so i'm just not understanding but anyway um people was mad about that and then this is one girl she's about 19 and she's just like real immature with her mouth like she just talks and talks and talks and says what's up whatever is on her mind like we get out of 8 at 2 45 some days we leave at like 2 30 2 35 2 40 and we'd be ready to go normally she the first one out the door or whatever because she just i don't know she sneak out of what but um today everybody was ready to go because you know the class we wasn't really doing much or nothing in there so we was all had our pack we all had our stuff packed it was ready to go and she made comments talking about why can't people be original and just do their own stuff um i was the only one that left around 235 ish and stuff like that and i'm like girl come on now be for real you acting like we're not leaving to go home around the same time we all leave when the teacher said we can go what are you talking about but I don't know, y'all. It just be some weird stuff, but all I can do is focus on my work. Like, right now, in each class, I have at least, well, it's one class. That's my low class. I have an 82 in the whole class, so I'm trying to work that, you know, build that up. But it's a lot of different things that go into that class, um, like growth and development, fundamental. Well, not fundamentals, like um, family journey and all this other stuff. Anyway, let me get off of here because I'm getting out of y'all nervous, and I don't want my phone to overheat, so I'll see y'all in a minute. Hey y'all, I'm back and I was supposed to bring y'all with me, but I, uh, when we went out to eat and stuff, but I didn't have my phone. I actually left my phone at home because my mama was using it for an important call. And you know, when you're making those important calls, like they, the time frame be planned. So, um, instead of me just having her in her call and start over and all this other stuff, I just went ahead and just left my phone at home. So yeah, I have like two hours worth of notifications and stuff on my phone, missed calls, all that. But anyway, I guess this is just going to be a talking video. Y'all, I'm kind of upset with myself. I'm out of breath. But yeah, I'm kind of upset with myself because I really did. Uh, I got a real bad grade on one of my uh, tests today. And it was really, really easy. But I started overthinking myself. I went on. It was for um, ethics or whatever. Ethics is real simple. It's common sense. But so it was 15 questions on there. And... I got the first set that was like 30 points right there itself. It was just definitions. I got that. But one thing that I noticed that I did wrong that I need to stop doing, I will study throughout the night. Sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night and I'm studying. I study in the morning. Like I listen to the lecture again on my way to school and stuff like that. But I need to give my mind a break. And 
basically when I got to school today, I pulled out my laptop and I just started going over the stuff that we was going to go over test on. But I just finished studying over last night. I just finished um, listening to the lecture on the way to school and stuff like that. So I really should have probably listened to something else or did something else or whatever, or just refrained from um, like looking at stuff again, because I actually got on there and started looking at, I started looking at the nine principles of nursing. And so I learned everything that I need to know, fresh it up on all the nine principles of nursing. And the test was basically over the definitions. Like I put the definitions and I got those all right. And then the only question that was about the nine principles of nursing was how many principles of nursing are there? Nine. So I was thinking that there was going to be about the nine principles of nursing. And then when it got to those questions and they were like scenario questions, basically like um, this, um, for example, it's like, Miss, Mr. W is at the hospital and um, you, notice, you notice that he is having a problem with high blood pressure, but his medicine is not working and stuff like that. So then it will be like, um, you go and you stand up and for him and get him the right medicine. What, um, like what, like not principle but what are you like what are you doing basically i forgot how the question went but it was like um advocating respect um benevolence or whatever and it was something else but basically advocating yeah that was the answer and in my head i'm like okay it's advocating but i didn't put advocating yeah i'm thinking about all other stuff so i messed myself up and my mind was not prepared for it to be so simple and that's the hardest thing like i said that's the hardest thing that is about school for me it's times when you when things are just so simple and you just blow it out of the out of proportion and there's other times where it's like should be blown out of proportion but you think it's so simple if that makes sense um I know people are probably tired of me talking about nursing school but that's my life right now like I really can't breathe I really can't eat I really can't sleep or anything like that because it's all nursing school and you know I'm in an accelerated program they pretty much took a program that was about 22 months and turned it into an 11 month program so we have tests about once or twice a day um hard stuff quizzes we got a lot that we have to do and so we don't really exactly have time like right now I'm pretty much studying for about three things four things or whatever excuse me so the stuff that i learned today i am testing about it tomorrow only thing is like my pharmacology math and stuff i don't really have a problem with that so it's certain things that i do notice that i do not need to really put to put that much time into i'm still trying to figure out methods of learning and all this other stuff how to organize my studying and stuff in which my grades are not bad at all for real but the score that i got today i can't keep doing that and then it makes you nervous because then you're like okay well i did good this week but i still gotta do it again next week but anyway i digress um i'm about to start back studying y'all i really came to say it was nice like dinner was nice i don't know why i feel so uh i'm out of breath because i feel like i have a lot of sinuses or something going on i feel clogged up but anyway school was okay eventually um the rest of my day was pretty nice dinner was nice but i was thinking about studying and now i'm here and i'm gonna study i got coffee and everything um wait i'm just disappointed y'all in my low grade but my grade in that class is like 89 percent right now because it broke it down anyway y'all make sure you like this video if you like this video subscribe if you haven't already and also comment down below let me know how you do it and see y'all later